Hello everybody, it's Masan19. Welcome back to Mountain Blade 2 Bannerlord and the Bandit King. So, I figured out what happened in the last battle. I went back through and looked at the video. When I got knocked off my horse, I went to go jump onto the other horse. When you go to get on a horse, you press F. The key right next to F is G. And G is drop weapon. So instead of hitting the, uh, we got to get through this guy first. Uh oh, uh oh, I might be stuck here now. Why did that not kick in? There, it finally got away. My life didn't come back. Look at that. Probably because the battle didn't complete. That's why. Because I left the uh, kingdom. That's why the battle didn't complete. So I didn't get the life. Or else if I'd have got a life, I'd have taken them on. So that's what happened in the battle. Now, let's see how bad we got hit. Uh, we have 72 guys. Um, damn. We could still build that back up if we go after some caravans. I saw those looters going. Cawson, my favorite horse. My favorite horse. There he is. Whew. Whoa. Um, okay, that's a tough choice. Everybody knows how I feel about HP on horses. It's king, all right? But look at that maneuverability. The speed I can get away with. But you know... I just, I can't do it. I, I just, I can't do it. I can't let it go. It's... Oh, uh, I can't go to a tournament anyways. So, do I have enough? I should have enough guys... That I could go hunting some more. We got 73 guys. Ooh, we gained a clan tier. Oh, no, we didn't. We're in the same one. We're almost actually five, though. That's going to be a pretty big deal. As you can see, we're still... Look at how much money we're making. Is that insane? Well, actually, it's not come out right. I'm getting that plus 1,200. Okay, what do I want to do? I don't have the troops with me to do that. I don't think any of these guys are going to hold any blunt weapons. Because I would love to go after that bandit base. Oh, I can't catch him. Only way is if I could trap him. Who would I send? 
All right, highwaymen have shields. Is that a blunt weapon? I can't tell. Is that an axe? Yeah, that's an axe. I could still get some out of here. So, why don't I do that? Let's go after one. We might be able to come out with anywhere between 4 and 20 guys. I'll take the highwaymen with me. Since I know they have shields. And I count as two. I got a marker on me. The thing that worries me about that is that even if they do patch the game to where you don't get that marker anymore, that uh, they might not be able to fix that. Somebody got me. Don't hit me. I took care of three of them for you guys. Because a lot of times what happens is, is when they patch something, they're able to fix things. But if something has already existed, then it doesn't get fixed. So your character might be stuck with this forever. It's a possibility. Which I would think that would be something that would be fixed pretty quickly, because that's kind of a major deal, in my opinion. Look how fast I'm starting to run. I'm getting fast. And that's with bow and everything on me. You know, I got the bow and the quivers, and I'm running. Uh, the uh, Getting that perk really helped, though. Reduce the uh, weight by, what, 30%? Go get him, guys. Only one injured so far. Devastating loss to the Bandit King. Devastating. There was only 12 guys left. If I had my... If, if I had my freaking whole arm, we wouldn't have lost that, that match. No way. No way I would have lost that. Sad. There's two. So we got two prisoners. Really sad, guys. Feels bad about that one. But that's what I kind of talked about in the last episode. And which you guys have absolutely no idea what's going on. You don't know if I'm going to win the battle. You don't know if I'm going to lose it. You have no clue what's going to happen. And I think that's what makes it so interesting. Is you just, you never know. So, you know, you know, if you watch somebody who dominates all the time and you watch a battle, you're just going to assume they're going to always win. Always win. Oh, just all the time. But with me, you never know. So, I think it adds a little bit of excitement to the game. At least I hope it does for you guys. Alright, so we're going to get about six or seven prisoners out of this. Which is fine. Are you kidding me? I don't know what the heck happened there. I have no clue how he stopped that. Whew. That was close. Mercenary horsemen. 
Thank you. I can take the Mercs. Um, you know, I could take them and sell them off. No, 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 no. Whoopsie. They're troops, you moron. Okay. Can I fit him into that corner? Can I actually do that? Let's see if I can do it. He's going there. He is. I got him. All right. Come on. Play this. Play your cards right. No. I let him get away. How could I do that? Oh, that feels so bad to do. I thought for sure I had him. I don't think this goes into a dead corner, though. He's actually going to get through there. He's just too fast for me. Is it? I can't remember where this dead ends into. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh, forget it. Oh. I don't need to train on you guys. I think there was another one that I could have gone to. No, those are those. I don't want them. We're almost healed up now. So, what do we want to get back into now? Like I said, we I just want a couple more pieces of armor. Um, You can see a little bit light on some of the armor. I think it's the chest and the shoulders I'm most concerned with. Yeah. Two chests and about three shoulders. So... Let's say 180,000 or so around that would be good. I'd like to pick up the 2010s. They, uh, what do they cost? Are they 20,000 each? I'd like to pick those up. Those are just so amazing. I mean, 20 body armor and 10 arm. And they're either 20 or 40,000, one of the two. I'd like to pick that up for most of our people. That'd be one, two, three. Four, five, six. So that'd be like 120 grand. So I could pick that up right now. And then all we'd have to do is pick up three body armors. So what? That'd be 270,000. We're only a little over 100,000 away from having all armor, everything ready to go, except for barding. And barding, we do have a pretty good amount of. We're definitely not bad on the barding. Uh, a couple of these people will not be, uh, you could see with him, um, the Wainwright, I believe is going to be infantry. So she's not going to need a barding. So I would, um, I don't really have to get barding. So let's just say we're a hundred K away. Let's just say that. I almost want to go run and pick it up now. It is a long way to go. I'm at 68%. No. Nothing here. Do I want to go pick it up now? I just can't say enough about those 2010s, though. Alright, who's in the tournament? Wainwright. I don't know if that's my wanderer. Look at Loud, Scholar, 
waist surgeon. It's like almost all of them are, if not all of them. I, does that, I mean, was it all of my companions in this? I mean, that, that is a really good call then. I mean, they're gaining skill out of this. It, that, that's an amazing call to just do these tournaments. That's the one I just got. It is not an improvement, but I think I'll hold on to it. Because we're about to get another companion. Okay, so... I would like to pick up those shoulders. So it's picking up those shoulders and then like three armor. You know, it's like 120k or so. But if you look at how much we're making, we're making a thousand a day. That's that's without fighting, that's a hundred days. And we're done. In fact, I screwed up again, didn't I? Oh no, we're not there yet. Looks like 115 off. So it's like 30 days and I can get another workshop. And that all comes from artisan community. It's what allows you to get to client tier six in less than a thousand days like nothing. In fact, this could be one of the fastest days I've ever gotten to client tier six. I don't know yet. So we're going to head up here first of all. Because I would like to pick up a cult. Hopefully they're only to like twenty four to 28,000. I hope. I'll have to look. But I'm really hoping that's all they are. Really hope. Look at the very bottom one in party speed. Batanian. Forest. Agility plus 0.4. That's what I talk about with Batania. Get a hundred cavalry only in a party and see what the bonus is from the Kuzite culture bonus. Guarantee it will not be 0.4. I don't even think it's 0.3. Nothing I don't think can, can match that. Now, in the open terrain, of course, it's not going to show that. How much is it? They do not have one here. Tournament. They only didn't win that one. And my boys, I think they might be mine, so I'm going to watch this round. I think they're both my companions. See, I like Warband. In Warband, you actually got the prize being the party leader. Xeonon the Surgeon, that is my companion. So, shouldn't I actually get that? There he is. That's my companion. So it seems like you should get it. Um, unless they're doing something with it. I don't know. But I don't win every tournament. That's for sure. Alright, do you have any... And you don't have any... It's got to be Batania. Another tournament. Third one. This is why I'm going to edit. Damn. I hate that. Came all the way up here looking for the shoulders and I can't find the shoulders.
Oh, come on. Are you serious? These have to be Batania. They're not... There's no way that they're Blandian. Are they? Maybe they are. I thought for sure they were Batanian. There's 55 of them, but I don't care. There they are. There we go. Yeah, see, they're only about 25,000 or so. Looks they only had one. And I should hold on to that as well. For the new companion. So the only plates I didn't check was staying on. And that sucks, they only had one. So the episodes are going to be a little bit weird with me cutting out the tournaments. I'm not going to know the exact time. So trying to keep these at about a half an hour is going to be a little difficult since I don't know how much I'm cutting out. They don't have one. So I came up all the way up here to only get one. Oh, that's pretty damn spectacular. Look at that. So unfortunately, I could only get one. But could I stay in the area? Are they at war with Blandia? No, Sturgia though. It is autumn. Two ten. That means the snow is going to be coming soon. I got them absolutely hammered right now. I don't want to get near that mess. I like to get that caravan, but can I? It's Olek. I'm not in a great position to do this. Damn it. So, by him changing colors, that means we took, yep, so he belonged to Car, I, I'm assuming Carbon Seth, so Van, Blandia took it, or wait a minute, Birdcheck or something like that, we took wherever he was an enemy out. So, once we took it, then he became friends. Why they're making this really difficult for me. Don't like fighting Sturgia. I 
Like rats. Ooh, a bunch of people just got taken prisoner. Where were they? Crap. Where were they? It was the perfect opportunity for a prison break. Where'd they go? Epicrodia. Not there. It may be Omar. That's the only problem, they get dropped off at a castle, and I can't get out of the castle. So, if some of these run over a little bit, you know, I'm going to try to guesstimate, but I won't be perfect on some of these. Alright, let's join the tournament. We'll do the tournament, and then we'll check to see if there's any prisoners. Gotta be kidding me. Oh, oh, oh man. We lost again. Jeez. Oh. Almost another one. Stupid spears. Shield Maiden beat the Lord. I think it's Shield Maiden's mine. Yeah, she beat the Lord. Nobody here. So, like I said, I don't know how many of these I gotta cut out to try to make them fit in there, so... You know, the times are going to be inaccurate. There could be a 24-minute episode. There could be a 32-minute episode. I'm not really sure. But I think it's the best thing to do. I think it's a very good compromise. And I hope you guys are okay with it, too. So I will see you in the next one. Take care. And thanks for watching.